Yep. So now he has to figure out how to get my fat ass out of here, <laughs> which is going to be a great experience. Can't I'll wait. The ladder. Blake's got the ladder. So normally this is like mm, out to here. Yeah. Well, I'm more worried about I think you can do it. They got this. Go play. See Brian. Look at that. Good teamwork. You excited for another day? I'm excited for every day. Oh, every day. Do you hear that, Lance? Every right. day. Racing eight days a week. Absolutely. Hello, friends. Welcome to day number three of the Canadian Swing. We have just arrived to Brockville. Don't judge me. Is it Ontario or Ontario? I would like to say Ontario, but I'm always wrong, so I'm assuming it's Ontario. Someone tell me, but we're here at Brockville. Uh, la 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 la. Late night, early ish morning on the road, but everyone's still smiling. Guys are unloading the car. I'm heading to the office. They're kind enough to let me bum some Wi Fi. So here's the hoping I've got some speedy Wi Fi for a two day vlog that is an hour long. Thank you, Cheryl, for letting me bum some Wi-Fi. It's still, it's still uploading. Guys, it is a two hour long, no, not two hour. Ah, it's taking me two hours. It's an hour long video, but oh, she got me flowers. I love her so much. She's so freaking sweet. I'm so excited that we're here. I wish we'd come here more often, but did uh, get a quick shower, but I mean, you wouldn't even notice. And, uh, yeah, let's check out the track and go check on the guys, go back check on the video, you know the drill. Displayed to the field 
as they come down the front straightaway. Williamson going to bring him through turn number three and four. Case number one, engine oil heat race number one is underway. First time up into turns one and two, the Baldwinsville Bandit. Jimmy Phelps grabs the lead. Mahaney off the momentum from last night, jumps to second. Williamson Sears and Darren Smith after Jan Boussier for fifth. One lap complete here in the case number one engine oil heat race number one. Score it to Jimmy Phelps as your race leader. Mike Mahaney on the bottom looking for the advantage. Engine oil heat race number one to the Baldwinsville Bandit. Phelps will win it. Second will be Mahaney. Not too shabby. Second. A girl with some good momentum. Second. Two laps to go. packs food to the races or you're going camping or road tripping you know you pack enough food like more than enough food because you don't want to go hungry I mean that's like one of my very main concerns in life is going hungry and I kind of eat I eat but sparingly enough that I make sure it lasts all week and then you get into the chicken fried rice and it's like bigger than my head this is how much we have left and tonight is the last night so I'm sitting here having a quick snack and I can almost guarantee Mike will finish this on a ride home so it's gonna come in handy but I have a fridge full of food that I just I haven't fully eaten because I've been too busy sampling the poutine which crap I got I gotta do that so always room Get this poutine. I haven't gotten yet. 
Okay, you yeah. found it. Yep, yep, yep. Seventy five hundred. That is this evening's payoff. Sorry, right, guys. Just wasn't meant to be. They're low on fries. And I'm not waiting because the cars are now starting to roll. So, no poutine review for Brockville. Unless I'm still hungry after the future. Or why? It's time for the ultimate thrill ride. 27 drivers in their 800 horse saddle saluting you as they prepare for battle. It's the big block modified Super Dirt Car Series. Ladies and gentlemen, a shower of big block power is about to send a shockwave through Ontario. Brockville, Ontario Speedway, let's ride. Night's winner at Drummond looking to pick up some spots early on, and he is moving quickly here as we click off lap three. Mahaney looking to get by Jimmy Phelps as they come down the front straightaway. That's for spot number eight. He'll have it at the line. They'll roll through turn number one and two. He'll try to get Britain as well as they power off the corner. Mike Mahaney on the move. Britain going to bite back tooth and nail as they go into three and four. Mike Mahaney doing a great job putting the right rear on the outskirts of the speedway. He'll come off the corner and take the seventh spot away. Takes the seventh spot away from Britton. Now he'll go after Tim Fuller as Fuller works the inside portion of the racetrack. I think the bugs are eating us. Gonna fire. We're gonna go back to green flag racing with them.
was like a hard fought six man. That was wild. The fuller one. I love it when fuller wins. So we got six. Not setting the world on fire, but it was a little what's up out there? A little, little skating ring. But one piece. Technically we went forward. So tonight went good. We were all pumped up from our win last night and uh, we uh, timed pretty decent, moved up one spot in the heat race, got ourselves in the redraw and uh, you know didn't redraw the best number but uh, backed up as far as 11th I think on one restart and then clawed back to 6th. Uh, track cleaned off pretty quick in the feature and um, didn't, didn't find a line as quickly as I needed to you know there was there was some different stuff people were doing up front to get to the front and um, seeing that is very helpful or finding it first I'd say uh, car was very good you guys did an awesome job I want to thank everybody for this uh, Canadian swing if you will and uh, we had a lot of fun I think we made the most of it and it was it's uh, very memorable and we accomplished something we haven't done before. So pretty pretty happy going home. We got more racing this weekend, but we got one day to catch up. Everybody ready to hit the road? Wait up. Yay. Oh, and I got, I got. Yeah. Mm, oh, yeah. Hi, Good job. Thank you. And I will say, pretty good. Oh, well, where's um, mine? You got two hands and two legs. Oh, I'm sorry. I, was just I offered earlier to go get you food. So that was earlier. You only get one shot, man. One shot. So I will say, unless it's they're just like mega curds, these are interesting types of curds. I've been re I've been reviewing poutine all week, Brian. I never know if you're talking to me or the phone. I never know either. Okay. But fries are cooked nicely. Lots of extra gravy and looks like a pretty good amount of cheese. So I mean, what track was it first? Was it? I forgot what track we raced last week. This week, poutine was like sparse stuff in this. This is, this is pretty hefty. So I would give this nine star. I still think I didn't do extra cheese curds on this round. So late RPM definitely like wins the. Poutine review. Uh, the the Everyone's confusing me. So I'm gonna oh, yeah. go, yeah, lay RPM for the best poutine. Congratulations. But I also did pay like the extra money for that, so yeah. Oh, I also forgot we gotta close out. See ya. It's Bye. been fun. Bye. Bye. See ya. It's been fun. Did we all have a fun time in our? Canadian swing. Absolutely. Absolutely. Great. It was a great time. Got to see a lot of people. I don't know where Jax is going, but going we're to gonna, gonna put him up in his little cubby hole. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this. If you did, like it, share it, subscribe, head over to Patreon, become a part of Club DTU, and we will see you guys Friday. You hiding out there? Yeah. Friday at Albany Saratoga Speedway. Oh, and shout out to all of the employees here at Brockville hospitality like top of line so thank you guys